On this episode of Eat Up Silicon Valley, we're in sunny Santa Cruz, California to try some Venezuelan-style arepas from Pana Food Truck. We're meeting with the owner, Herman Sierra, who has found his niche in Santa Cruz, serving up a great selection of freshly made, hard-to-find arepas and juices. Let's eat up. So we're in my town in Santa Cruz over at Shanty Shack Brewing, and we're checking out this food truck this guy loves. Yeah, my friend here, Sam, has never had an arepa. 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 So what is a arepa? It's a Venezuelan, almost like you can think of like a gyro. It's a maize wrap. I got the one with shredded beef and cheddar. You got the one with shredded beef and mozzarella. And a plantain. Too. And I got I added plantains on it. Yeah, it's kind of like a taco. It's a cousin of a taco, a taco cousin. Maybe. Really? Where'd you get but that, it's got that Where'd you get that information? I've had it before. Can we fact check that? It's the cousin no, of No, we don't do fact checking here. It's not what you find every day. It's not Mexican food. It's Venezuelan food, right? So it's not a taco. It's, a, it's an arepa. An arepa. Let's go order. Cool. So I'm going to dive in. This one is the... Uh, the chelua. It's a cornmeal pocket. Pocket, okay. Yeah, that we grill it. And then we open it in half and we fill it up with meat, cheeses, vegetarian options, vegan options. Wow, look at that thing. Yeah. And it's all made fresh. Yeah. Everything from the from like from scratch. Yeah, from wow, scratch. from corn. And this Handmade. goes this goes back so far in Venezuela. Oh yeah, hundreds, hundreds yeah. indigenous. Indigenous. Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's do it. And it's got plantains, shredded beef, and I got the one with um, cheddar, cheddar, cheese. cheddar cheese. Okay. Mmm. Yeah. Mm, nice. So good. The Palua normally does not have plantains. No, you add that one. I added that on. Yeah. I love that sweetness, right? I wanted to bring out flavors. Oh, this is popular in Venezuela. In Venezuela. What do they call this avocado sauce? Wasacaca. Wasacaca. <laughs> Wasacaca. All right, let's try a little bit of the avocado sauce. So much more flavor. Mm. Oh, yeah. Good. It's not spicy. It's not spicy, no. yeah. So this is a, a garlic sauce. A garlic sauce. Yeah. That's pretty common too in Venezuela. Wow. Man, that's really good. Really, really good. That's a different plantain from that one. Different plantains? Yeah, because what are they called, these plantains? Uh, tajadas. 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 And the saddle plantains, we call it tostones. You gotta get the tostones. I wish you guys could feel this right now because it's warm and toasty, but look at the char mark on there. It's sort of like how Sergio likes his pizza with a little char. I like it too, so that's very legit. Plantains right here, you got the shred beef, you can see. We have mozzarella, black beans, avocado. Oh man, this is going to be a messy bite, but here we go. That was good. Fresh avocado, the beef is bomb. This uh, maize no. cornmeal is so good. Love it. I'm a big fan of this. I'm coming back. Yeah. How long have you had your truck? 10 months. 10 months. So 10 you haven't even been open a year yet? No, not even a year. And yeah. you travel all over the, the Santa, Santa Cruz, Cruz County. County. Okay. Salud. Cheers. He's got his watermelon juice. I got the papanon. Wow, that watermelon juice is good. Papalona is good. It's made from like a sugar cane. It's really, really good. Venezuelan drink. Tell me your story because it's an amazing story. So my brother and I came from Venezuela like 2016. We know arepas, you know, since we born, we eat arepas. So my brother and I, my brother told me, oh, we should like do some arepas and go to the streets and sell them. We started kind of selling them. Wrapping them in foil and everything. Foil, <laughs> and we did like a juice, like a Venezuelan juice too. We actually were in the street and a police came and caught us and told us, you guys gotta go home because we cannot, you guys cannot sell food in the yeah. street without like license. And I told my wife to like, oh, we should like open something. And then we moved to Santa Cruz and we just... And then you went. started Pana. Yep. And now like you've only been open 10 months, but you you had a lot of people here just a minute ago. Yeah. So you get rushes of people. A lot of pop, yeah. We've been really popular just from social media. Yeah, and you have a good relationship with local breweries, right? You yeah. go here, you go to Humble Sea sometimes too. Yeah, before, yeah, Humble Sea, Watsonville, we go to like different breweries. Watsonville. Croatian breweries. Yeah. yeah. That makes sense because they don't have kitchens, they don't cook, so... It's, true. it's a good partner. Yeah, oh, yeah, great partner. Awesome. I looked a little bit into arepas and they go way back, like pre Christopher Columbus era. This is a food native Pretty. to Colombia, Venezuela. Mostly, this is a Venezuelan food truck, but it's that region of the world. Um, I said it's a cousin of a taco. It doesn't it's look not, anything okay. like it a doesn't taco. Look, it's more like a gyro. I would say it's like a distant, like maybe a second cousin twice removed of the gyro. Gyro. Okay. Gyro. Don't say gyro. At least not saying gyro. Gyro. Dude, you look like twins. Oh now. my gosh. I can't wait. Hold on. Same shirt, too. 
Wow. And the same shirt. Wow. Now we really great, look like twins. I just need a great beard. Jeez. <laughs> kooks Club. We're just a couple of kooks here, yeah. for sure. See you on the next Eat Up. Bana in Spanish translates to friend or homie, and Herman is definitely our newest homie. His story of hard work and determination is why he has one of the hottest food trucks in the Central Coast. Remember, next time you're checking out a brewery or looking for something different to eat near Santa Cruz, follow Pana Food Truck on social to see where they're at and be prepared to shock your taste buds with a delicious arepa. See you on the next Eat Up. Whoa, look at that cheese, dude. Mmm.